Very good man. Can I have your resume? Okay, please introduce yourself. Okay, sir. My name is Rama. I am from Srikakuna, but currently staying in Hyderabad. I have one year experience as a manual tester in a startup company. I have good knowledge in STLC and STLC and functional and non-functional. I did uh, different kinds of testing and sanity and smoke and, and regression and bug life cycle. And I have knowledge for Java also. And I am learning uh, automation and uh, SQL and HTML. And my hobbies are uh, listening music and watching. Technical on based on code Java. Okay. So we ask you a few questions. Are you ready to answer it? Yes, sir. Okay. Here is your first question. Okay. What is mean by sequence programming language? If it, uh, education programming takes step by step, it is called uh, sequence programming language. Okay. What are the disadvantages of C language? C is the first programming language. See, um, see disadvantages including unrelated code execution, no security data, no, no code visibility. Okay. Can you explain about OOPS? Okay. Uh, Java is the um, uh, object oriented programming language. It for, it's following the OOPS concept. OOPS concept is four principles uh, abstraction and encapsulation and polymorphism and inheritance. Okay. Can you tell how many types of in inheritance are there in Java? Inheritance is four types and the single and uh, hierarchical and hybrid and the multi level. Okay. Can you explain detail? Okay. First one uh, single. Uh, one parent class and uh, one child class. This is called uh, single inheritance. And uh, multi level. Uh, there are more classes and uh, child class uh, become parent class. And um, uh, hybrid, uh, combination of three or four uh, inheritance. This is called uh, Okay, very good. So, can you tell about constructor overloading? Okay. Uh, there are uh, two or more constructors. Constructor name and class name is same. So, parameters and uh, different uh, uh, data types of parameters and sequence of parameters and number of parameters. This is called the constructor overloading. Okay. How many types of access modifiers are there? What are they? Okay. Uh, access modifier is the four types and public and private and default and protected. Okay. Can you explain detail about these four? Okay. First one uh, private. Uh, if this access modifier is um, in class and they cannot access from outside class. Uh, this access modifier is uh, within the package, it cannot access from outside class. Outside package protected. Uh, this access modifier is uh, within the package, outside the package, but two child, child class only. Uh, public uh, access modifier. This access modifier is anyway within the class, uh, outside the class, within the package, and outside the package. Okay. Can you defer array list and linked list? Okay. Uh, first one uh, li array list. A linked list is a double linked list. And um, array list, um, uh, it, uh, it used to uh, store the data. Uh, linked list is uh, used to manipulate the data. Okay. 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 What kind of application you can develop with Java? Uh, Java is used for web application, desktop application, enterprise application, and mobile application also. Okay. So, can you tell about polymorphism? Okay, polymorphism is a concept which one a particular operation will exhibit different situation and different end situation. Behave. Okay, here is your last question. Okay. Can you differ between heap memory and stack memory? Okay, the allocation memory store the object. It allocation uh, memory store the variable value. Uh, it is memory uh, heap. Uh, it is memory is not safe. Why? Because uh, all thread, it is used to all thread. Okay, Rama. So, you have done very well your technical round. Okay. So, you need to improve some of your technical skills. So, they are better. And you are coming to your uh, communication skills are better. So, no need to fear. Okay, done.